Hey YouTube, this is Rancic from RCC Entertainment bringing you another comic book review. This is not my normal setup. It's just been crazy all around today, so I haven't had a chance to actually record. Um, so I'm recording this kind of like a real quick, uh, just face to face, you know, showing my face again, guys. So this is Daredevil Volume 2 from Chip Sadarsky's Chip Sadarsky's run. Um, it's pretty good. It's fantastic. I love it. Uh, it continues from volume one that I read already. Um, whole thing with Matt Murdock, you know, trying to be framed and, you know, trying to get his innocence. Um, he's dealing with a lot of guilt and stuff like that. But, you know, Matt eventually, you know, fights through it. You know, he's still looking for certain um, things, trying to see if Fisk is still involved. But the whole thing about Fisk, like, you know, like changing a new leaf. Because the whole king, like the whole uh, crime, it's like now that he's mayor, he wants to like turn in a new leaf and become a good person and stuff like that, good entrepreneur. And to me, that's shocking. I'm like, wow, Wilson Fisk, the kingpin, being an entrepreneur, that is never, ever would have done anything like that. But I like it. It's something new, it's something more entertaining. Uh, and um, I, I can see it. I can see it. I could definitely see uh, how this is going to turn out to be. I feel like this is my my prediction. Because we can, like, you know, guess what could happen, you know. Um, I'm thinking that Wilson is going to end up, you know, of course, converting back to bad. But I feel like maybe because he thinks that, you know, the crime families are, like, plotting against him or something like that. Because he's being too, like, chillaxed and stuff like that. And he probably wants to try to like do something for that, you know, try to go against it and do his own thing. So it's going to be really entertaining and really interesting to see what how that plays out with that, you know, about the whole situation with um with him doing all that. Um, now, when it comes to Matt, Matt just trying to like get back to normal. He feels life is better without him being Daredevil. Like he feels comfortable just living life the normal way, let the cops do their jobs, like. Even though there's so many corrupt cops out there in, in Hell's Kitchen. And, you know, I feel like things need to happen. So I feel like the whole overall aspect is that right now I feel like he's going to ha happen to get back into being Daredevil eventually. Because I feel like something's going to happen. And he's going to have to go back in the suit. Um, but I feel like he's picking his time um, to go back in that suit. Um, so it's going to be very interesting, very, um, very appealing. Um, but spoiler alert, and you guys know now, spoiler, we get to see Elektra, you know, and I, I'm so super happy about that. Um, and Elektra is like talking to him saying like, what's up? Like, you know, have you given up, you know, like, why are you not the devil anymore? You know what I mean? So it's going to be very interesting to see where the, the issue continues on and how it's uh processed further you know what i mean um but so far it's a good issue i mean i feel like uh a lot of things can happen you know what i mean so i'm definitely looking forward to continue with chips run chips is doing a fantastic job um also guys uh lately i haven't been uh i'm gonna be slowing down on some of the videos I'll be doing some videos, um, mostly on Mondays and Wednesdays still. But, uh, you know, financially things are a little tough right now. So buying items might be out of the picture. So I might be doing a lot more comic book reviews on the meantime um, until, you know, I gather enough money and I'll buy some more, uh, you know, cards and stuff like that, especially Pokemon. Um, I'm trying to get my collection up there, you know what I mean? And with Pokemon uh, and Yu-Gi-Oh as well. So I am definitely would love to keep on doing that, especially I did pre-order three um lightning collections uh karen uh not karen wow ashley yellow ranger in space uh black mighty morphin power ranger zach um and zeal red so i'm definitely gonna be do, um talking about those in the future sometime in september so stay tuned for that because i will be opening those up um, but I'm going to try to do my best to uh, buy a couple of more other things. But uh, right now, finances are kind of hitting me. So um, stay tuned. Uh, I will try not to bore you guys as much as I, you know, hopefully don't bore you guys. But <laughs> I'm going to try my best. Uh, keep this spicy and keep this fun as much as I can. 
Uh, I've been working on a lot of my personal projects right now, so I haven't had a chance to uh, uh, do some more shopping around, with, but you know, I had to use some of that money also to uh, fund my projects. But still looking forward, guys, to keeping the channel alive, keeping the channel awesome. Um, and yeah, man, it's been great um, for all the support, guys, that you guys given me. Um, and it's been amazing. Um, but uh, yeah, guys, as always, guys, Daredevil Volume 2. Definitely check it out. It's a really great read. Really great read. You gotta check it out. Um, Daredevil has been an underrated superhero forever until, like, you know, the Netflix show made him a little popular more again. And I'm very happy about that. And he's one of my favorite Marvel heroes of all time. So I really think that, you know, Daredevil needs some love right now. Um, and it's, it's amazing that Daredevil gets some love. And I hope he c continues getting love for the next 15 or 20 years. I really want to see some more Daredevil um, movies. I want to see some more Daredevil shows. I definitely want to see a Daredevil animated series. Like maybe the 94 version of Spider-Man could have been have a real good spinoff around that. And I think it would have been great to see that. Having a Daredevil um, animated series, a Daredevil video game would be awesome. A la the Arkham style fighting engine. You could probably have that and make a really uh, awesome, intriguing, compelling story. Um, maybe have Born Again inter in interrogated. Uh, wow, interrogated. Thank you. I, can, I don't know English anymore. I just don't know. Um, put it into the, the video game. You know, it'll be, it'll be an amazing experience to do that. Um, yeah, so what do you guys think? W what's the best possible thing we could do for now for Daredevil? Do you guys think it'll be an awesome time to have a video game for Daredevil? Do you think it's an awesome time to have a future film of Daredevil? Do you think it's an awesome thing just to keep it, you know, a TV show? Because I actually enjoy the TV show a lot more. So, I, you know, what would be cool? You know, maybe an anime series. Maybe, um, I don't know, what else can we do? I mean, we already have a lot of toys. But, you know, what, what, what can we also do for Daredevil that would be awesome? That you want all these creators and these content creators and these people who create, you know, the Daredevil shows and Daredevil movies and Daredevil animated series if they, have, you know, make one in the future. But what we want these studios to do, we want these studios to make some more Daredevil, right? So I think it would be a great idea if, you know, we just shout out, you know, just do a shout out and be like, hey, let's do this. Let's make this animated show. Let's make this video game. Let's make this new TV show. Let's, let's make a, a, a feature film. Let's do something for the man without fear. You know, so I think it's um, compelling, you know. Um, and I'm a big Daredevil fan, a big Daredevil supporter. So I definitely will see um, some stuff like that. But what do you guys think? Leave in the comments down below. Um, and yeah, guys, um, stay safe out there. Crazy world that we live in. Um, and um, get this. Definitely read it. It's amazing. Fantastic. Fantastic read. You'll love it. you will you will care for it okay so um take care guys as always stay safe